<laughs> Yikes! Welcome back to our Let's Go Eevee Blind Nuzlocke. I am Neo Marquis. I'm here with Nia. Let's go! We've got an encounter on this route in this grass right here, and then we've got to battle this gambler. We gotta run over to Celadon City. We've gotta get the Soul Skull, beat up Giovanni. You know the drill because this is 20 years in the making. And Vulpix! Vulpix! I want my Vulpix back! Whoa, calm down. All right, this is a legal Nuzlocke encounter. It, so the, just to clarify, no, back here at all. The, uh, the species clause only works for you, or I should say the species clause doesn't have to work only for you in that if you've had a Pokemon, you can get rid of it and re-encounter it. But uh, you could have waited for me. <laughs> but in this case, something bad happened to Moxie the Vulpix, and we're making up for that now by re-encountering. We just happened to run into a Vulpix, so this is it. I told you I would find you another Vulpix. Yay! I didn't know it was going to be that easy, but nonetheless. All right, I will let you name it. Vulpix is our first encounter, and then it's on to Celadon City. I swear I will do what I can to make sure we don't lose this. Ah! Um, go ahead. <laughs> okay. You good with that? Yeah. All right, Roxy. And if you want, add it to the team and replace uh, Lord Sizzle. They're equivalent level anyway. So, um, Vulpix number two on the team, and uh, I feel vindicated. What's that? Oh, jeez! Oh, no! If also the Firestone, we can get one of those easily. Nice! Oh, no! It's so glorious, though! We're gonna have already had one! You missed! Ah! I didn't miss that time, but it probably looks way No, alright, let's try to coordinate this a little better. Right? Wait, 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 wait! I was gonna use a berry! Oh, okay. Wait. Alright, go for it. Oh, we actually don't have that many left. Yeah, we're, we're gonna have to figure out where to get those. Come oh, on, Polly. See ya! <laughs> Next. Oh, oh. man. Next. There we go. Sort of. It's not oh, a Oh, it's so glorious. Uh, we'll have to evolve Roxy the Vulpix. There you go. Oh, yay! A non encounter, but nonetheless. I found a nine tails, though. Okay. Yeah, well, I mean, when you saw the Vulpix, I, uh, I knew that we were going to I mean, that was the one to go for, so who knew there wasn't cool. anything else? I didn't think nine tails was in the wild. That's cool, though. That's amazing. Oh, I love the tails. According to an enduring legend, nine noble saints were united and reincarnated. Uh, how are they reincarnated? This is an evolved Pokemon. I don't know. Ah, that Pokedex isn't very reliable. Let's talk to this ace trainer. Hey. Oh! Hey! Alright, if you want to evolve that thing right now, let's check its moves before we go for it. I can catch a lot of Pokemon around here, so buzz off. Well, oh, you're real nice. Geez. You know what? Get that. Here we go. We're gonna wreck you now. Ace trainer Kyla. Oh, her name is Kyla. Kadabra. Abracadabra. Okay, you're about to get down. Now, I don't know. Well, we'll, we'll keep the Pokemon we got out. But I've noticed uh, there's a gambler right yeah. on the other side of the fence. Yeah, I know. Uh, oh, that's right, I did. Now he's rock solid. Flash! I didn't think Flash wasn't moving anymore. Okay. There was our accuracy. Flash! Ah! Uh, oh. Come on, and roll, you gotta you gotta hit your attacks. Alright, so since you're going for that, and it's gonna take it out now I'm gonna go. And roll, dig a hole. So much for the ace trainer. Dig a hole, dig a hole, dig a hole. Goodbye. And the choke. And it's super effective against both of us, so we have to be kind of careful about this one. Just in case. I don't want anything to happen just now. Nice. And he's got the burn, so his attack goes down. Uh, why? See ya. I popped out of the ground as a giant boulder and rolled into his face. Kyla, you didn't buzz off. Yeah, get that. Five Ultra Balls. Things are starting to get better around here. Some higher level Pokemon, we'll see evolutions. Alright, let's uh, let's take out this gambler, or I'm sorry, this gamer, and we will do it with the Pokemon we have now. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, alright, so let's battle this guy. Alright, 
and I, I'm a rambling gaming dude. Yeah, like, like we're supposed to believe that's not a rambling gambling man. All right, gamer rich. These guys are underhanded. Oh no 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 no! no. I know what he's trying. He's going for horn drill. Uh, what level is he? Oh no! <laughs> Don't you <laughs> take this thing out. You're immune to it. Um. He's gonna outspeed me, and he's a water type, so even if he doesn't go for horn drill, um, oh no. Oh, he can take out the king of kings, too. Throw Matt in there, I'm not gonna leave. Um, if he goes for a water move, Matt will, will be okay against it. If he goes for horn drill, you know, he's got a 30% chance at actually hitting that thing, so. He's going for it, I know he's doing it. You outsped him. Can you take him out? Can you do it? Should be able to. Oh wow. That was good. Oh jeez. Wow, that got a really powerful. No, no, no! I you hit it. his horn drill. You get bent. That was my ear. Why do they always hit me? Ow! Sorry. I was supposed to kill and I didn't. What now? <laughs> Screw you, Just that's put something out there. I don't care. <laughs> anything will do. I don't, anything. We need to start. I uh, go ahead. It would be it would be a very dirty, underhanded tactics. I'm not going to do it. But I need to exit before we battle these guys because I knew he's going to do that. He's a quick attack. Oh, are you kidding me? I can't believe he hit. Why did they always land it on me? You guys. Are Oh, I hate these. We need to stop battling these guys. They go for the same strategy every time. I was gonna say before we battle them too that uh, watch us lose another Pokemon, but I didn't say it. All right, well, <sighs> good start. <laughs> good start. I can't believe he landed it again. Let's let's go. Let's go heal real quick. At least I knew that, you know, if I had put that Nidorino in... Alright, so, Matt is now dearly departed. Uh, he can just stay in his grave in here. So, I can't believe he landed that. I wasn't going to question the mechanics behind it, and I wasn't going to sit here and look it up. I, I believe one-hit KOs do... Yeah, no, I'm positive. One-hit KOs... But how is what? your chemistry? Look at your Pokemon. Or you look good at Pokemon. How is your chemistry grading? Well, you look good at Pokemon. Oh, but I'm how like, is your what? chemistry grade? Well, as a matter of fact, whatever you are, I'm assuming a scientist. Uh, we need to talk about that chemistry, super nerd. Anyways, um, if he had hit King of Kings with that, who was the same level as him, I would have raged. So, all things considered, we did the best damage control we could, but. Um, I, I am very inclined to stop battling gamblers. <laughs> oh, well, go for it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw some rocks. I can't believe he could go. I mean, the only one, the only death that was really a, a fault of mine so far was Raichu has really high stats all around. Its attack and its special attack are pretty much equal, and it excels at both of them. Uh, Chansey only excels at hit points, so I should have known better. But nonetheless, um, I didn't think he was actually going to land that horn drill. 30% chance. You should be informed. You need a strategy. It's called damage control. It's a good strategy, I recommend it. Rocker Glenn. Set Alright, so that's two evolutions. Oh, nice. And if you don't take this thing down, well, I'll just use Rock Slide. I was gonna use Dig because it'll be super effective, but by the time I get Dig off, you'll be done with it anyway. Ah, Matt. Oh no! I knew I was gonna be alright because that. Man, I can't believe that Horn Joe landed. We gotta stop battling these gamers. They're underhanded. They're dirty tactics.
But, I mean, to my own credit, at least I didn't put Vulpix back in. No, no, I don't want to battle him anymore! I don't want to lose any more Pokemon. I'm done with those guys. I want to battle these two, see if we can run right up Main Street here. In between them. No. Meowth is so cute. And yeah, tell me more about it. You know what was cute? Beedrill. And now that's gone, isn't it? Class Andrea, so, you know, introduction to life. Get ready for disappointment. <laughs> Alright. Well, uh, this is a great start to the Team Rocket. <laughs> Excuse me. I'll set up the Stealth Rocks and then uh, go from there. Yeah, I was gonna say, uh, we gotta get through Team Rocket. I, th I think we'll make it. I think we'll be in our right episode. Maybe, heck, maybe we'll stop in the middle of a, of a plant. Who knows? We're gonna have to go through the entire hideout. Alright, right, here's your Stealth Rocks. Who's coming out? Let me guess, she's got all me out. Well, Cute. I meant the last one's Persian. No, probably not. Alright, well, I'm digging a hole. I don't know about you, but... Oh, man. Ow. Using your priority moves. I'm, I'm still digging my hole. Actually, he probably just has a bed. I don't know if he has a bed either. Tamatoa, 25. Raza, 21. See ya. That's what I should have done against that nope, scene. Meow. It's too bad that I couldn't uh, outspeed it. Why do they call for me when I'm not cold? I don't know. See ya. I'm gonna win this battle underground. I don't need you and your meow. Meow. <laughs> well, um, that was an interesting character. How's the other one? We're showing off our Pokemon. Do you want to try? Sure. Show off my bee drill. <laughs> Last mate. Oh. I get it, because now she's got Pikachu and Team Rocket had Meow, so it's kind of an Ash versus Team Rocket thing. I don't know, I'm gonna throw rocks at it. Hey, wait, when did I change outfits? <laughs> I did it for you. I just noticed. Evie's even got on a shirt. I was oh. back at Lavender at the fucking tower. Yeah, I know. I remember you getting it, I just don't remember at what point I changed the outfits. No, I did. Oh, I know what it was. I accidentally I, I, I accidentally disappeared and then when I came back. Darn it. Oh well. Another underground tunnel. Hey! I can't no. reach it up there. Calm down, we'll go back. Hey, that's fine. I'm I'm fine. Are you fine? You just started panicking. I'm like, hey, we'll go back. Sanity check? No, we're not touching it. All right, so then, uh... Oh. No. All right. All righty, well, we're back. I ran off for a sec, but... Do, all right, so we're gonna... Oh, yeah, this guy, this guy, we didn't battle, right? No. All right, school's fun, but so Pokemon. All right, so everybody's healed up, and I ran off for a sec, and then that's good. So we'll go west of here, but I think we have to go through the tunnel because that guy wants water. For some reason, all the guards here don't have enough money for any vending machines with keep forgetting to bring their lunch. They don't want it. And so, other than that, uh, we are going to pretty much, I think we're going to cut this like in the middle of the, uh, the rocket headquarters. All right! Magnemite. Sanity here. Okay, I'll, uh, yeah, I was going to say, he's not going to go for me. Yeah, hit you. Here we go! Goodbye. Ouch. You know, that brings up a good point here that I remember. So, remember in the original anime, when, or any of the anime, when uh, when a Pokemon faints, it gets spiralized, you know, mm -hmm. swirlies? So, at one point, Ash is battling somebody that has, uh, remember the Bell Sprout, that new Kung Fu? Uh -uh. He's battling a, uh, in the Indigo Plateau, uh, Bell sprout that's just destroying everything he's got. And then uh, he uses muck to crush it. I take my duty very seriously, but gee, am I ever thirsty. 
Can't, Freddy can't let you pass through here, kid. Well, darn it, the only vending machine's on the top of the, on the wall. We'll just have to go through this conveniently placed, uh, uh underground tunnel. Who's this dude? Sleeping Pokemon. Yeah, you know, there's so many problems around here, man. We're trying to take them out one at a time. Uh, either way, so at one point, Ash's muck crushes that bell sprout to death, and when it's when muck gets off of it, its eyes are X'd out. They're not swirly. So he killed that thing. X accuracy. Speaking of X, yeah, these pads are cool. I like this. Vulpix alive and well. <laughs> a little bit different. <laughs> the anatomy changed on this one a little bit, but <laughs> overall. No wait, they're both female though. No, this one's male. What? Yeah, this one's male. Oh god, I named it Roxy! That's alright, it's it's Rock C. No, I thought it was female too! No, it's male. Oh no, it is, it's female, I'm sorry. I was gonna say, what? <laughs> I am wrong. You derped me out there for a second. I was like, oh my god, I'm, I'm so sorry. Never mind, no anatomy changes. We're good. Huzzah! Here I am. Do I go up into where? There's an apartment store. Uh, well, that's where the vending machine is on the road. Alright, so let's check out... Actually, we got... This city's gonna be big. We need to check out everything. Heck, we could do a gym battle if you want. Yeah, hopefully, hopefully we'll see if there's anything on the other side. Um, oh, we can battle her. Uh, we already got a Route 8 encounter, so this one, this one will count. But there are Vulpix crawling everywhere, so... I knew we'd find another one. Ace Trainer Yvette! She's got three Pokemon, actually. Oh, uh, yikes. This thing could have Mega Pokemon. Actually, that'd be a problem with Vulpix. Um, he's going to outspeed. That's gonna hit him, so... I... I'm gonna dig a hole. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and dig a hole. Oh, darn it, I should've gone for Rockstar. He set up lights for me, okay. Let's see what he's trying to do. See you later. Luckily for us, we have pretty much all physical moves. Unless you want to use Swift, but... I would recommend playing. I don't think it's gonna take that. So. Oh, there it goes. Okay, never mind. Oh no, I dug a hole though. Sorry. Darn it. I don't know why I thought you were gonna one shot the thing. Um, I am not digging a hole against you so you can earthquake me while I'm down there. <laughs> That's, I'm not gonna let that happen. Do I have anything that flies? I don't have anything that flies. Not anymore. No. Doug Trio. I'm just gonna use Rock Slide. He used Earthquake. I'm weak against this. Please be okay. Please be okay. Please be Oof. Alright, we're good. We're good. Now we found out what happens when we <laughs> Yeah, if I had dug a hole. Well, I, I, he, he outsped me anyways, but, you know, Doug Trio is like one of the fastest Pokemon in the Um, regardless, if I had dug a hole and he went for Earthquake, it would do four times damage to me, and that would, that would, that would be the end of me. <laughs> Nothing would be left of that. Great, now you can use a water type on me. You know what? I'm gonna switch out to Krabby. Or you know what? No, Krabby's too low level. What level is this seal? 28? He can take it. But I'm, everybody knows I'm not gonna do it. Switch out. Because if he goes for. I don't know how fast he is, but if he goes for Bubble Beam or something and I, and I lose the end roll, that would be a loss for the team. See? He went for a priority move. He was gonna try and get it. He, I mean, he probably wouldn't have taken me out, but still, he was going for it. That's what you get. I think Sizzly Slide must burn. At, or Sizz, what is it? Sizzly Slide? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that must be a 100% burn ratio, because every single time you've used it, it burns. Oh, why did I go for Toxic? I just said it would burn. I'm on autopilot sometimes, because I'm like, yeah, it's not going to live this. But it does. I gotta get off of autopilot just in case. Because your Swift wasn't doing as much. The light screen's gone now, so I can take it out. Um, sometimes I'm just on autopilot, like, yeah, it doesn't matter what move I use, it's gone. 
That Aqua Jet was so good in my my Moon and Ultra Moon series. Having a priority move that you can take stuff out with. So I, I highly recommend having a priority move when you do those lines. Who is this? Uh, nah, I don't need more. The only thing I'm gonna uh, fire spin, I'm probably gonna get rid of. But, uh, either way, well, I don't know what I'm gonna get rid of fire spin for. I haven't decided. If you got any suggestions? Go for it. Flamethrower is gonna be replaced by fire blast. What was that? Wait, wait, go back down. I saw something. Aha! A berry. <laughs> a nana berry. What's in the little house thing here? Is that like, uh, What's that? Oh, that's the tunnel. Okay. Yeah, we just went around it. What's this guy want? Coach trainer. A small path between towns. Teehee. Route 7 is nice, right? Are you ready? Now let's play an ensemble. Is this Route 7? I think so. I guess we could get an encounter here then. I have to check if it's Route 7 or not. Far-fetched. It was definitely a duck. I thought he might not be, but was it me that was arguing that? Yeah. Yeah. I, I thought he wasn't a duck. And I looked it up and I was like, hey. Yeah, he's a duck. He walks like a duck, he quacks like a duck. Must be a duck, or must be a cow. I guess I'll go for rock slide. If you take stretch, this thing out, I'm gonna stretch, stretch. Nice, okay. Razor Leaf? No! No, 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 no! Okay, okay, I'm okay. Oh. I didn't think he was gonna have Razor Leaf. I don't know what I thought he was gonna have. I gotta watch out. These guys constantly, if it weren't for the fact that they don't have good stats or using the off moves, you know, it's not stab, um, I would be destroyed. Wiggly Tough, alright. Um, I'm out. You can heal if you'd like, just in case. I don't know if it's gonna have, like, mock Punch or anything. I am definitely out to see it. Level 30. Um, I think Vulpix can take this. And uh, just in case. Send out the King of Kings. It's, uh... <clears throat> yeah, I think... Yeah, Wiggly Tough just has really good hit points. Uh, it's not particularly super high in everything else. So, I think we'll be okay. It's <laughs> thrilled, thrilled to bed. Side. Ow. What kind of move is that? I don't know, but or I, I do know. How about a uh, burn? Yeah, I think it gets stronger. Um, I don't. Yeah, I don't really want to use. Oh wait, it's normal type. I have. I have double. Kill. I was gonna say I could use toxic. Nice. Burned, and its attack is gonna go down. So. Oh, <coughs> oh that's right. It's a fairy type now. Um, well, at least it's not going for Fasada. Darn it. It changed it, I forgot. There's, that means there's probably not a lot of normal types left in this game. Alright, well, either way, Peck will do more than that. Actually, you'll take it out. No, you will not take it out. I will. Poke, poke, poke. See you. <laughs> yeah, I definitely need, uh, I need Sludge Wave or Sludge Bomb. It was a great session. Hey, uh, do me a. Oh, no, no. Just hold your ponies. I was gonna say, do me a favor, uh. Facade. I think King of Kings can learn Dig. It's a spunky move that deals double damage with the Pokemon that has a status, using it as a status condition. Well, good thing that it wasn't burned before it used that. <laughs> hold your ponies. Alright, this is Celadon. Route, route 7. seven. Alright, we don't have a Route 7 encounter, so. Well, I'm gonna heal before I do anything yeah, else. Yeah, sure, go for it. I agree. Alright, we're back. Actually, if we're gonna do this uh, encounter, maybe we should get the fortune teller. There's a weird fortune teller in there, and I didn't want to keep that on screen. But we can go back because we never, we didn't get the fortune red. But, um, if you want, we can go back and get the fortune red before we make this encounter. Mm, what good will that do? I don't know. We already have a Jigglypuff because I don't know what the fortune teller even does. We already have a Jigglypuff. We already have a Pidgey. What else is gonna spawn? We need something else here. I'm trying to be careful because they're all over the freaking place. Yeah, they're out of there. Alright, uh, well, uh, here, run run back. Run back into the town and we'll, maybe it'll respawn the Pokemon. Alright, now turn around and go back. 
Let's see if it respawns new Pokemon. Yeah, it does. Look at that. Alright. Oh god, that's dangerous. I can't see back here. Eradicate. Come on, pop up here. Technically, Eradicate's the only thing we have not encountered. Ah! Here's another Vulpix. Yeah. Oh god, don't want to rat it up. Vulpix. I mean, we could use another Vulpix as an encounter. <laughs> You could try and get a shiny, I guess. I don't want to see anything shiny on uh, Pidgeotto, Vulpix. I was going to say, if I stand here, can you see the other side? No, you can't see the other side of the no. screen. That's a dumb question. <laughs> we're looking yeah, at the same we're looking TV. at the same screen. I'm I mean, just scared to walk further because I don't want something to like trigger and be like, oh, we're stuck with this. Uh. I don't know. I, I haven't seen anything at spawn of particular use. Um, it's kind of weird how this work, This game works different because technically, uh, Nuzlocke's it's the first Pokemon, but this time we can actually selectively pick our team, so... <laughs> Freaked out. He's trying to come after me. I didn't want him. I didn't want to eradicate. Eradicate, eradicate. Oh all over the place. There's not a lot in this route that's different from 8. Plus, I don't know if we already have a Route 7 encounter or not. I'm pretty sure it's the first time we've ever been to Route 7, but we can check later. We can check later. Is Somebody there not spawned! more grass somewhere? Huh? So is there not more grass maybe on the other side? No, that yeah, was Route 8. Uh... I guess this is Route 7. I mean, here, check the map. Open the map. Let's take a look. Alright, that's Route 7, now go to the left. Hmm. 16. Yeah, this is it. This is Route 7 at its fullest. Alright, well, I guess we can always grab another Volpix. That makes me sad then, because I could have had the Ninetales. We didn't know that the Ninetales was there. We can grab a Pidgeotto. We could grab the Raticate, I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. Yeah, but I don't know. Oh, what's holding you back from the Raticate? Chance that something greater is gonna spawn. Yeah, Mewtwo's hiding in the in the left bush. Oh right my right goodness, here. not like <laughs> that. Maybe maybe I want another Chancy. Ah, uh, we'll give it one more shot. We got Pidgeotto. Rat is probably the right idea. Here's a Vulpix. That's our Vulpix. Oh, there's one. Yeah. Rattle. You had to say that, didn't you? Well, I stopped it him. It ran right for me. I stopped him. Barely. Ugh. At least he can't come up here. Well, he can, but not as well. He can't just run at you. Yeah, yeah. That Pidgey can run at you. <laughs> That's a species of loss. Pidgey. You know what we could do is we could swap the team out and then just start catching Pokemon here. Oh, ah, no tails! Yeah, that that works. Hey, I told you, something better always All spawns. Right. You just gotta be patient. All right, well this counts. Oh, we are so low on raspberries. I'm gonna use a different ball. All right, the ponies. Well, if you're gonna do that, I guess I can, uh, I can do the same thing. Okay, you go for it. <laughs> Doesn't feel good, does it? <laughs> no, it doesn't. Are you ready? Where Oops. were we going? There we go. Great! Alright, well, now we've got a Vulpix and a Ninetales, and the Firestone on, right. the, on the bubble. Nice, there's our encounter. Alright, well. Now all we gotta do is name it, so it's a uh, ball in the airport again. Now let's name it. Take down. Ah, uh, nah. Keep old moves. Catch combo 2. So that's the last thing we actually caught. This is also a female, so yeah, you can name it. I'm good with that. Let's get out of here and then you can name it. Oh, there's a Jigglypuff. Let's see. We already have a dude. Yeah, no. I was just saying, oh, it's spawned over there in the corner. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. 
<coughs> Moxie. Uh. <laughs> In memory of Moxie. Sorry, Moxie. But With now we got two X's. Moxie. Two X's, two I's. <laughs> Moxie. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, I just realized that. I thought I'd put something else, but no, it's Moxie. Yeah, that's fine. Moxie the second. Oh well. That's what the second X is for. Yeah. Alright, well, this was a good encounter. Certainly not wasted at all, and now we can go on to Celadon. In fact, it may not benefit, or it may benefit us just to do a gym. Let's just get one. What do you think you're doing here running around town? We're Team Rocket, don't you know? Ah, I forget you, man. You're a joke. I was gonna say, there's an item to your right, and then there's actually... I think there's an encounter to your left. Static Eevee. Which in this game, I'm sure isn't gonna be an Eevee, but... Um, yeah, the, the, the back of the department store. Should go straight? Yeah. And then, right there. And then we'll climb up a bunch of stairs. And I'm gonna have to teleport every single time. Go over and over and over. Oh wow! But at the top, this guy gives you. He, he's supposed to give you an EV, or actually, it's just laying on the table. I think. No, no, no. There's definitely an EV. What was that? We'll, we'll go. We'll go back to it. Here it is. Nice. All right. Yeah, there's the Pokemon. All you can, er, as you can see from all my notes on the board, there's nothing that I don't know. I even know the whole world can be found in oh, from inside your Nintendo Switch. Dude, you're breaking the fourth wall here. Alright, well. So connect with your friends and enjoy trading. I'm, 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 I'll read it. There's a good link trade, link trades and battles. Oh my goodness, there's a good deal of text written on the board titled Link Trades and Battles. When you can just, I'm... will you read it? Yes. No, I'm skipping the mechanics. <laughs> if you'd like to trade or battle with other players, choose communicate in the main menu and then select play with others. Choose either local wireless or an internet connection to communicate with another player, then choose to trade or select a battle format. If you and another player enter the same link, you will be connected. Link code. Cool. Sorry. Play rough. That's not a, an EV. Nope. That is a fairy move, though. Uh, check, check the TM really quick. Let's see what Pokemon can learn. Maybe we can give it to Jigglypuff. Play Rock was kind of Mimikyu's signature move, so... Play Rock. Uh, no, okay, never mind. Alright, that's fine. So I guess, yeah, the, the EV's gone. It's just a TM now. Alas, now what was this down here? Oh, that's so cool. Look at the original poster in there. Actually, it's all over the room. Look at that. That's wow. all the original posters in the game. I love that. Definitely nodding out, to, or a nod to uh, 20 years of history. And a fire extinguisher, because you gotta be safe. Might better put that in there. Okay, now I don't know what's to the left of here. The girl that's over. Oh, it's just I, I was gonna say right there to the left of the city here, west. A girl used to give you fly. I don't know what she does now. All right, so instead of Team Rocket, I think we're gonna do the gym. Then do Team Rocket another episode? Yeah. I'm good with that. I can agree that. All right, you want to do the fortune teller? Yeah. Alright, so I will keep this on. I don't know what this girl does, but she wants 10,000 yen to do it, so... Uh, and she's creepy, so that's, you know, it's always good to give somebody who's potentially possessed 10,000. Shall I foresee the nature of those fateful allies you have yet to meet? I'll charge you just 10,000 when you like to know your fate. Sounds sure. like a ridiculously good deal. I can never pass. Let me ask you a few questions. There are five, there are five flowers of different colors in front of you. Which flower do you water? Pink. Aha! Heh! It's heh! I see. I see. Alright, you take the reins. Now, among the five flowers I mentioned earlier, which one will you thin out if you have to? What does that mean? Uh, let it die. Which one do you sacrifice? I want to quit. Not after 10,000, you know. Uh, yellow flowers can be kind of pretty. Blue are good. I've never seen a green flower. 
you seen a green flower? I can't think of one. Not off the top of my head. It's just the petals. I got the leaves are. Meeting, God, she's creepy. Meeting, greeting, every time so fleeting. Hello, goodbye, every day beneath the sky. Nature, na hate ya. Wouldn't wanna teach ya. Abracadabra, nature is so fabwa. I knew she was full of crap. Saint Caro, that's what it says. Saint Caro, Saint Caro. Fate is guiding your path. The encounters you will have this day are likely to have a naive nature. And now I'll take your payment. I wish you good fortune. That was it. Oh, she changed. Okay, so okay. that's kind of cool because you can you can get the nature that you want. But I just blew ten thousand yen on, on nothing. So well, we got ripped. Speaking of ripped, this is my trusted pal, Polygram. It evolved from a poly world when I used a water stone on it. Hey, what's Brock doing here? What's up, Brock? Bye. Hey! I didn't expect to run into you here. I'm on my way back from visiting the Celadon City Gym. Keeping in touch with other gym leaders is part of our duties after all. Yeah, that's why you went there. The girls at the gym all turned away for some reason. Turned me away for some reason, though. Sorry, Brock. Actually, I have some pewter crunchies. I brought them as a gift to the gym here. Alright, so a bag of rocks, right? You gave me pebbles. <laughs> Oh, and you're probably going to want some tea after eating them. Pewter crunchies can make you thirsty. Alright, we got tea. We can go open up that pathway now. Ah, I don't have enough left to give that thirsty guard now. Anyway, it looks like you've been visiting gyms in other cities. I wish you the best. Ah, forget the guard. We'll turn it to tea. Ah, a Nidoran, good choice. Nidoran female. Ko! Being surrounded by my beloved Pokemon while enjoying the rest of a nice cup of tea. Everybody has got tea. While but... enjoying some rest in a nice cup of tea. Moments like these mean the most to me. I'm sorry, but you're you're <laughs> you're messing you're messing with me. It's driving me crazy. Just a, a little bit of light trolling on a nice weekend. Nothing like good old trolling. Um, 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 um. This isn't a department store. I'm having a meeting with an important client. You want to join in? Really? You just, you just, that's a sarcastic, right? Oh boy, it must be nice working at a company where you don't ever have to wear a suit. I'm in formal wear, man. What are you talking about? Yeah, no, I get, uh, I get nasty stuff on my clothes at work. I don't want to wear a suit and cake. Alright, this must not be the department store. I don't know where we're at. Oh man, weirdos. <laughs> I'm the game director. I'm very happy that you're playing this game. Good luck with filling up your Pokedex. If you collect all of the Pokemon, let me know. Yeah, yes. Every game they break the fourth wall. So put... they literally put the game director. Yeah. That's funny. I read the story. Hey, tell me, don't you think Erica is cute? I like Misty a lot too, and Sabrina. If he wrote the story, that means he wrote the story 20 years ago. I don't think he looks like that. Oh, well, that's pretty cool. I like that they, they always. I'm kind of worried who this creepy guy is then. Messing with it could bug out the game. Don't worry, Nintendo. I won't emulate, I promise. Me? I'm a programmer. Okay? Inter I'm saving that for last because I don't. You probably won't know what I'm talking about, but come back once you've earned a title. Well, I know what you're talking about. Anybody that's got Twitter knows. Oh, goody. I'm the one who designed you. Wait, no, no, I'm sorry, he says it this way. I'm the one who designed you. Goody. And look, they all have a Switch conveniently on their desk. I wonder if that's what it's like working for Nintendo, having a Switch on your desk. I don't know, but I don't like that one. Nobody does. Onwards. Either way, if I didn't know what a title was, my my literal twi Twitter name plug in here wouldn't be Neo King Master Marquis, <laughs> which I'm gonna change that back after we're done with this. This better be good. This better be good. It's not. All right, let's go back down. 
pass that's not the department store. Oh, I know what that guy gives you when you complete the poker decks. He gives you the shiny charm. It cuts the rate of shinies in half, so uh, your odds are, are extremely high. And who's looking up spoilers about the game? They they post all of this for you on Twitter. I'm just joking, dang. This is, uh, in fact, uh, the shiny charm has been around for, I think, three generations. Mm. Your history. <laughs> yawn right on camp. There's the department store. Your history lessons boring. Handmade Pokemon accessories. Go take a look at the fifth floor of the department store. I'm on a Nuzlocke. I can't afford these kind of things. Back after an extravagant, <laughs> lovely time buying a bunch of stuff and getting a bunch of TMs and waters. Coughing is the best partner ever. It spews out poison gas when it gets angry, but it's usually very sweet. <laughs> it's sitting there <laughs> spewing gas out as we speak. All right. Uh, I don't know how to talk to that guy. I can't reach you. Can you come over here across your little moat? How do you get thing? there? The house has no doors. You must have swam over. All right. Uh, this is the game corner. We'll come back to this. I lost again at the game corner. I guess people who are so good at the games, there must be putting... Uh, okay. Must uh, be putting in more effort than I, I do. Well, we'll come back to this because it's a storyline. So let's let's uh, let's go here first and then make sure our Pokemon are all healed up and we'll take on the gym. See, that's where you get a few... Oh yeah, we got a flower. Flowers. So that's where we get a lot of choices are where do we want to go. Uh, we can battle this gym, we can... Who's she? Oh, shouldn't I be able to reach the gym? Okay. Yes, you can. Either way, we have a bunch of choices of what we can actually do. Huzzah! This is a hotel for people. And we're full, unfortunately. Alright, well, what do they have to say? I came here on vacation with my brother and my boyfriend, just the three of us. Isn't Celadon beautiful? Why? Why did she bring her brother along? <laughs> I bet it's a little kid over here. Yippee, I'm on vacation. My sis brought me along. Yeah, meanwhile, he's just like, uh, this ain't gonna work. This is gonna be a terrible time. <laughs> Excuse me. Gyarados. I love the paintings of Gyarados on the wall of Arknight. I didn't see Arknight. It's not Gyarados. Alright. Next. Uh, dude. That game where the Pokemon fly through the sky is a huge hit. We're positively raking in cash now. I feel like I'm on Cloud9. Is he a retired veteran of Team Rocket? Oh, yeah. Don't touch the posters at the game corner. There's no secret switches behind any of them, of course. Maybe if we offer Pokemon as prizes to the top scores, we can make even more money. Huh? What? I wasn't talking to you, kid. Well, good to know there's nothing behind the paintings at the game. Right, that's good to know. Posters. Um, yeah. Then I won't have to waste my time. What are you staring at? Get lost. Uh, that? Oh, okay. I won't make you leave. Let's go to the restaurant. Grandma, I'm hungry. Good for you. We're all hungry. Oh, no, I'm not a gamer. I don't like that guy. But I have a good defense against those gamers now. So we can go back and battle that one if I want. Stretchy, stretchy. My Pokemon are weak, so I have my medicines. Oh, I thought maybe we could battle these guys. You know what I heard? Seems there's several floors. Yeah, we don't like that. We're heading there. Don't worry, we're getting that. Nom, 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 nom. I'll eat all the curry they can carry. I don't like you. Yeesh, I played so much of the game corner that my hands are twitching. Games are way too much fun these days. Yeah, of course, that's why you're at the game corner all the time, because you're addicted to games. Huh, I thought this would be like Pokemon Moon where you can sit down and eat. Guess not. Well, you can eat. I'm just a ghost that has no stomach. Solomon City takes pride in its effort to keep itself clean and beautiful. The area around the game corner is a different story, though. It's a bit rough, a bit rough around there. Yeah, it's a rough side of town. Go you know, around. Drives your account. Alright, gym time. This is really nice, I like this area. 
there's Snark Rats. How do we get to the gym? I don't remember. I don't know. Who's following you? I don't know where oh, I'm going. Okay, well, follow me this way. First, chop down this. You just did that. I know, but they came back. You'd be amazed how fast these points were. Alright. Now... Which way to the gym? Is this really... Oh, yeah, here. Uh, I, I guess we just missed it. I wasn't looking. <laughs> Okay, now before we go in, we want to make sure our Pokemon are all ready to go. There's a creepy old man with all the girls in the gym. For fun. My Jigglypuff has an adamant nature. It's easy to raise its attack, but not so easy to raise its special attack. Its double slap is a real slap in the face. Yeah, especially when it hits more than twice. Ah, good that it kept this in there. This gym is great. It's full of strong trainers. Yeah, that's why I keep them through the window. Alright. Um, set Vulpix up by me. Or is number two. That doesn't work. You gotta do it in party. Oh, you can do that too, I guess. Add Graveler back. Actually, Graveler shouldn't be. You know what? Instead of Graveler, put Nine Tails. Yeah. You know what? Oh, yeah, put Nine Tails. Put Graveler in place of Ivysaur. Okay, that's it. No more changes. All right, fine. We can do that. Good lord. Do actually, this. Well, no, wait, do this. What, what, what's worse is I actually got the team wrong. I wanted I to someone instead of crabby. My god! <laughs> oh, so you want to challenge Erica, the gym leader. Uh... <laughs> I'll have you know, we only let trainers with cute Pokemon enter the gym. Do you have one? Let me see it. Show a Graveler, please. Show a Graveler. No. Please? Yes! Huh, Graveler? <laughs> okay. Um, it's a rock. <laughs> okay. Well. Wow, look at this gym, though. Very pretty. Yeah. <laughs> Let's crab walk over to Erica. Ah, you're the other one. I'll show you my cute Pokemon. My cute Pokemon is a boulder. With arms. <laughs> okay, if you're gonna be sending Oddish out, we're gonna wreck you so fast. This is gonna be easy. Especially if you're level 38, you're gonna breeze through this. I'll just use Fire Spin. Maybe weak, but it'll take it out. See ya. Yeah, this will be a fast gym, so... I don't know, this is, uh... This is definitely a lot nicer than the, uh, the gym was in either Fire Red and Leaf Green or Red and Blue Yellow. This is amazing. Good thing we have that. And don't have a Krabby that's literally sitting there with pincers. Nope. Ow! I don't know what that was. Do you want to battle all the trainers, or go straight for her? Why not? Oh, welcome. I was getting bored. Why not? Bop that. Beauty my. Execute. Well, I'll give him this. The levels are scary. I'll go for a flamethrower. Oh, never mind. I, you know what? I was going for that because I didn't know if you were going to do a lot. See ya. What's bad is that when, uh, <laughs> when I get done with this, I'll just pull out uh, Ninetales. 
Give me a break. Hey, you're the one that was bored, lady. <laughs> Alright. Where are you going? Uh, I'm going over here. I'm going over here. That's weird how they don't walk out of you. Weren't you peeking in here earlier? Yeah. No, there's a dude outside who's peeking. Uh, Picnicker Tina. Ooh. Remember that voice for Valpo? Bye, 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 that is ridiculous. That move is broken. It's more powerful than Bite or Crunch. And it puts up a light screen for you. Or actually, it puts up a reflect for you. Like, since when do moves do two effects at once? Like that, that's crazy. She walks up to me. Hey, look, something, something, something. She likes grass, it's easy to raise. To me, yeah. Uh, I feel like there's an underlying message here. I'm willing to accept this. I'm actually something else. Uh, I feel like Oddish and Gloom. Oddish and Gloom. Overkill. I have no. Alright. Since you're gonna overkill it, it doesn't matter what I do. In fact, I feel like Eevee's gonna solo the gym. I used Fire Spin. A oh, Weeping Bell. Wow. Like that. Oh, cute. Uh, it doesn't matter what I use. Because Eevee's gonna take this for the win. Alright, so Eevee may be over leveled. But let's be honest here, we didn't even really catch too much stuff with Eevee in the party. Eevee leveled up fairly naturally, it just flew through the, the levels. Yeah. I mean. I mean, they saw it at the start of... what episode was that? At any of them. Where are you going? I'm going this way. Where are we going? Too much further. I don't know where this maze goes, but I wanted to go this way first. Alright. You can go that way. I mean, I'm gonna go back that way, but I saw more vines, so I just kinda wanna see if there's any items or anything back this way, because obviously... okay. Start of the gym, nice. Obviously the gym around. leader itself is up at the top of the thing, so I was just wondering what it was. Way. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Good golly. Crabby. I love the way Crabby walks. Walks like a crab. <laughs> I mean, yeah, but he's really fast, see? Yeah, I see. Like, if I let him go forward past us, he'll fly past us. Oh, that was boring. That okay, was crabby. boring and did no reason. <laughs> I want to see King <laughs> Gabby's probably gonna evolve. <laughs> He's hiding! <laughs> wait, 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 come back here. <laughs> come back <laughs> over here. Okay, no, 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 come, come, stand like this. Okay, now walk, walk this way. Watch, watch his face. <laughs> <laughs> you can't see me, you can't see me. I'm trying to catch up to you. <laughs> <laughs> What's your hobby? Oh hiding? my gosh. My hobby That's is That's the funniest thing. He does. He puts his claws up right when he goes behind the bushes. <laughs> Beauty Lori. Lori's only got one bloom. Gloom and doom. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Okay. Oh, Kavi needs to get some. Okay! Balls. He uh, did! Heavy crab walk. Yeah, I definitely want to see I want to see the Kingler. Kingler has that giant claw. He can just... Okay, Woo! 29! What level did you say it evolves? 31? 31. Hey, we're going to have two Ninetales. Two Ninetales? Did we even check the moves on Ninetales? No. I don't think we did. I don't know if that's Fire Blast or not. 
But we can both have nine tails out then. Yeah. Okay. I wanna check real quick. Alright, go for it. I've <laughs> never brought my card T. It's actually a lower level than uh Volpex. Oh. oh. Awesome. Great moves. Okay, well. <laughs> Ember. <laughs> okay. Volpix is gonna be sitting here uh, firing off fire blasts. So we might just use uh, the evolved Volpix Nine Tails instead of. Welcome the... to the gym. You'd better not underestimate the nice ladies here. Is this an ace trainer? He's stabbed. God. Excuse me, instead of the ace trainer, Mary. The one we caught. I didn't think it was gonna be so. Bad. That's alright, we can switch that. Maybe, we'll, maybe it'll serve two, uh, two different roles. We'll give it something. And it really doesn't matter what I do, so. Right. See ya, Weepin Bell. I just noticed, when I said that's it, I knew you could do what Eevee kind of does that. Yeah. just kind of glances at me a little bit. Tangela. 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 What happens if I shake the Joy-Con? Oh, nothing. Nothing? I was wondering, up there is a symbol, so... Yeah, I don't know what that it is. Doesn't do anything, does it? Does it? Oh, wow! Something actually survived? And he get burned. And now he's stuck in a fire spell. Oh, okay. Oh! Well, there goes my health. You better be careful about that. We'll give him a potion. Uh, actually, yeah, you, you go ahead and... No, 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 hit it with a sizzly slide, because I'm going to heal up. That way we don't have to waste time out of speed. Yeah, that, that'll be that. No. I'm not risking it. I'm at that level where even one hit point matters. Support trainer used <laughs> super potion. It's Marquee! The noble Marquee. Yeah, every time you use a special move like that. Oh! Beaten. Broken beaten scar. That one's gonna be the exit. Alright, down to. I'll go this way. You can go that way. Yeah, that's the exit. Krabby knows Vice Grip. That should be able to cut through. Oh, you've been spotted. I hope you don't have a bug or a fire type. I had a bug. I had a bug. <laughs> Alright, if you want to conserve some of your sizzlies, I can, I can take these out. I've got 15 point doors, so... Oh, actually, I want to know what Batty Bat looks like. I mean, other than it's got a terrible vein. That is a fierce looking tap. See ya! Yeah, why don't you use a uh, Batty Bat? I'm curious what it looks like. Actually, you might take this out, to be honest. Whoa. Dang. That was, uh, that was brutal. It's too bad that... Yeah, now, now I have a free reflect. That is so broken. It's, uh, unfortunate that an attack that cool has a name like Daddy Man. Alright, I'm assuming that this is not going to be... First off, the partner EV is the only one that can use that, and then I'm assuming that... Going forward in future generations, we're not going to have Batty Man as a cool. This is a special, special occasion. Oh, stretch! Stretch, 
stretch, stretch, stretch. Alright, a couple more trainers, I think. I think the one on the left is the one that Erica and the one on the right had to get out of here. Alright, let's go ahead and get that rainbow badge. Okay, no more trainers, just Erica. And her fainting spells. Oh! Well, oh, you gotta read this. Hello, lonely weather, isn't it? So pleasant. <laughs> I fell asleep. Oh dear, I must have dozed off. Welcome. <laughs> She's like... My name is Erica. I'm the gym leader of the Celadon City Gym. I'm a student of the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are all of the grass type. Well, I'm sorry. Did you perhaps wish to challenge me? Very well, but I shall not lose. I've She's got for... fainting spells in the middle of the battle. She's going to stop calling attacks. You said fainting spells. You called it narcolepsy earlier. I don't know which one it is. I think... Oh, uh, she's not fainting. I think it's narcolepsy. Yes. Alright, unload your fire moves. Here we go. Tangela, you're a roasted marshmallow. I like roasted marshmallow. Oh, this is gonna be a little more toasty. Does it have speed? Curious. Nope. I'm pretty fast, so it's gonna be hard to have speed. Easy. First marshmallow we got burnt, so I got sent out the second one. Bye. She's going with race. Best one. Alright, well, I don't imagine she's got anything that can one shot me, so even if she does outspeed me. Oh, jeez. Okay, Tangela must just have really good defense. Oh, you crit, that's why. I thought Tangela had insane defense that I wasn't aware of. I missed my flying throw. Sorry, meep and bell. Yeah, this is, uh. A walk in the park, quite literally. Rip! See you later. GG. Easy. Give me the badge. Perfect! No problems at all. Level 30? I, I didn't get Fire Blast this episode, but hey, this is pretty good. Concede defeat. You are remarkably strong. Almost got the money back to that hat. <laughs> Must confer on you a rainbow bridge. Badge. Jesus. <laughs> Try again. Ugh. Rainbow badge from Erica. Rainbow badge raises the level of Pokemon willing to listen to you to level 50 for Pokemon that you have received from other trainers. If you like, please also take this with you. Mega Drain. Half the damage it inflicts is drained from the target to heal your Pokemon. Wouldn't you agree that it's a wonderful move? All right. What do you think? I think that's a good place to Talk call to it. Talk to Evie, and then we'll uh, we'll call it. Yeah, bye bye. Very happy. Mostly wave this tail around, trying to get everyone's attention. Well, you certainly got attention. Well, good job, Evie. You pretty much one shot everything except that Tangela. So, uh, what do you think? I think it's a good place to end it. Excellent. With that, we bid you farewell. Humble and proud, I am Nino Marquis, and we will catch you next time. Bye!